Joey from Easy Lawn Tilts here. All right, so I just want to do a quick video on uh, the throttle setup, throttle cable setup for the Duramax 500. So after you reverse the governor spring, what I did was I took a piece of angle aluminum, a piece of old uh, brake lever that I had, the barrel, and then I double nutted it through here, as you can see here. And then the throttle cable goes through the center of the governor arm. Hey, little spider. And if you look on this side, you can see. What are you doing? You're not in this film. You can see the uh, governor spring right there. So, and that's what it looks like when it's reversed. And then for the, the kill switch tie-ins, so I know this is red, but that's how the Amazon, uh, what's called kill switch came in. But your ground goes to here with the rest of your grounds. And then the other wire uh, ties into this yellow wire right here. Uh, that goes to this silver piece right there and that's how you tie in your kill switch this is the pull start model uh, so the little line right there means on and then we got the fuel on choke on and then let's fire her up Just the idle. The idle screw is on this side of the carburetor. Right is to go faster. Left is to slow it down. Right fast. Left is to slow it down. And it turns off just like that. So that's the uh, throttle setup and kill switch for the Duramax 500, the XP20 HP. Or if you have the electric model, it's the XP20 HPE. Thank you guys for watching. Hope this helps you out.